We're now pleased to be joined with uh, Pat's prospect, Wyatt Stinton, following 2023 uh, spring camp coming to an end here on this uh, Sunday afternoon. And Wyatt, will guess, get your evaluations on what you thought of spring camp and coming to Regina a second time around. I thought it was pretty good. There was a lot of compete and effort from everybody and pretty good prospects. It was pretty high intensity. It was a good camp. And how would you describe just the experience for you now that you've been here for a second consecutive year and last year was your first year? Uh, it feels a lot better, uh, more comfortable coming, uh, seeing a lot of familiar faces and helping the new guys that are coming through when I, like I loved when I was helped and uh, yeah, it was good. A pretty good season with the Rink Hockey Academy U16 program in Winnipeg. Uh, how did you think you did this past year? I was a rocky path. I battled a lot of injury and a lot of, a lot of sickness, but it was good. I got to finish it off. We ended up winning it all out in Penticton, which was was awesome. And maybe describe your progression that you've made from this time last year to this time this year because you've seen your spring camp, main camp, and then now. So how would you kind of describe how you've progressed and improved over the last calendar year? Uh, just trying to get bigger and stronger, uh, work on the little things. Uh, I took a lot of things away from main camp, picking up pucks and just the, the little things that can make a player a lot better. Um, but yeah, just eating, eating properly and trying to get as big as I can. You signed with the Regina Pats at main camp. How excited are you to be a part of this organization and get uh, get ready for main camp in, uh, I guess, late August, early September? Oh, I was thrilled. That was awesome. I uh, definitely dreamt of it uh, from being little. I didn't know what team I was going to be with, but I was really happy it was with Regina. What kind of feedback did you get from the coaches over the course of your season this year? Uh, a lot of good. Uh, it was tough because I battled a lot of injury, but um, just to keep pushing and and uh, look forward to uh, everything that's coming. How do you think your game has been progressed since last year? Uh, just trying to pick up on little things, um, getting faster and keep picking up my head as much as I can. Just trying to read the game more. And I guess as we kind of put a, a wrap on spring camp, how excited are you? To, I guess continue to play with these Manitoba players. I know that's kind of been a main topic, but uh, from what I understand is that you know a lot of these guys. Yeah, I know quite a few of them uh, watching and playing against. That's pretty weird seeing a lot of them on the, in the same jersey, but I uh, know it was a lot of fun. We're now pleased to be joined with uh, Samuel Laplante following uh, 2023 at Pat's spring camp coming to an end. And uh, Sam, this is your second spring camp. Uh, how would you kind of describe the experience this time around? Man, it was great to be out here again. Like last year, all the 06s were warming, like all warm, well, welcoming us to the camp. And like, so I had to bring it back and like had to welcome all the 08s here. And it was quite nice to be the one leading and showing everyone how, how it's like shown out here. It was quite fun. Do you feel a little bit more comfortable coming back second time around? Yeah, it feels a lot more comfortable knowing that all the guys already and uh, getting to know some of the other guys coming up is also quite nice. Uh, you played at uh, IHA U17, U18 prep uh, this past season. Um, how would you kind of describe the way you progressed and your season that just was? It was a great season for us. Uh, we came, I believe, around seventh place in playoffs. It was quite fun. Um, we started off a little slow, but as the year went on, we got good chemistry together and great team overall. And what's the biggest improvement that you think you've made on the ice in the last year or so? Uh, in the last year or so, it's probably like movement of the puck. I feel like I've moved the puck a lot better now on the ice. And reading the plays also improves quite a bit for me. And bringing the puck up into play a few more times and drawing the rush is also pretty big. Sam, I feel like you've grown as well. Last year, maybe you were this high, I'm not sure. So I'll let you kind of take it away from there. Everyone's saying that. Like I was like around six foot mark, and I've grown like about an inch over the past. So it's quite nice to and get I up remember, that high. Sam, you were at main camp as well. What was the biggest learning experience from that playing with, against some of the older guys? And it was just like that big jump from U15 to WHL was a really big jump for me. And it's like I knew I wasn't ready that year, but showing how much more work I needed to get up to get to that level. What kind of feedback did you get from the coaches in that main camp and you put to work in your season last year? Uh, some advice that they got they gave me was uh, my first three steps on the ice. It's 
one of the most things I need to improve on as you go up in life and also reading the play faster and making quicker decisions. That also helped me get through this past season with IJ. What do you think you need to work on this coming season? Just improving on those first three styles and reading plays a little bit quicker and hopefully something new can happen. And uh, I guess last thing, what was your mentality or mindset coming into this spring camp given that it was your, your second time coming back? Uh, second time coming back was like same flow, like everyone's a little shy at the start but as soon as I knew someone, we started talking a whole lot and saw the entire dressing came in. It's, it's kind of like last year too, everyone's like a little chatter there, a little chatter here, but then everyone started talking a little bit more and we started to get together as a team.